another quick video and uh, this time I'm going to show you something different about the, uh, the Evil Within um, despite uh, the updates which I finally got installed uh, let's go ahead and show you real quick uh, be under the graphics go down to change despite this the uh, frame lock at 60 frames per second game still does not run in 60 frames per second uh, at, at 1080p anyways the um, <coughs> the other um, sure, get back here. the um, the other issue is the, uh, the letterboxing yeah, there is no uh, uh, point of view adjustment uh, when, when you turn off the letterboxing and change everything this is what the, uh, the game developers want you to to uh, play this game as. But uh, there is also another uh, thing that I uh, stumbled across uh, while uh, looking for uh, different uh, different ways to play this because I'm not sure if any of you noticed but the difficulties are all messed up in this game. Casual seems like it's normal. Uh, normal seems like it's hard and hard seems like it's impossible. Because yes, I have tried every single uh, difficulty setting. <coughs> well, I went ahead and downloaded some trainers because I can't get the console to work on this because I don't use the uh, the Steam uh, uh, application to run the game. So I prefer not to. I'm not crazy for Steam at all. I never have liked it. So I use Cracks in order to bypass that and. Uh, <laughs> in order to get like what you see on the screen like the uh, um, uh, uh, tons of matches and tons of ammo I use uh, trainers of course and one of these trainers that I picked up allowed you to change the color aspect of the game it looks totally different than this so when you uh, when you go to press the corresponding button all this changes. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit the corresponding button to show you what it looks like. Major change. It uh, it doesn't look so depressing. The uh, the grass definitely looks a lot greener. In fact, uh, everything overall looks a lot nicer background, foreground, even the character looks a lot nicer. When you turn on the flashlight, well not really a flashlight, you got your lantern, it makes everything look better too. So let's uh, go around here and turn the flashlight off for a little bit.
figure out what this was called, because originally I thought that this was a uh, special graphics mode. I didn't think I was close enough to get hit there. Okay, so, oh, right. Now I remember where all the enemies are at. You have to go to a specific place. Uh -uh. Go up here if you want. Just showing you a little bit of what the color looks like. It, it just looks so much better on this. Uh, yeah, I think this is where the cuts are. Who's there? No, don't shoot! I'm not one of them. I'm a doctor. Marcelo Jimenez. You, you were in the ambulance before a crash, right? Train yes, we're Russian. lucky to be alive. So Have you I seen anyone else? Like My patient, go. Leslie. I saw him running up ahead, but... But? The come this way. Commands, Quietly, mind you. Commands inside the notepad in order to figure out what each one did. And to do that, I used Google Translate. And now they... Google Translate has a keyboard on there. Have a look for yourself. You to, Those things uh, chased me all the way Russian into the village. Me too. Language. They're all over the place. So you can uh, type type it in. And then Leslie went through that the gate. You got the, uh, the other side set. Then all the Good lord. There are too many to shoot spot. our way through. Where that, uh, one of us could try to lure them away while the other gets the gate open. What You're the one with the gun. If you say so. Oh, I'll show you that here in a moment. Yeah, I'm wondering if I get... Yeah, when you complete a uh, hard mode, you get brass knuckles. Uh, you get a submachine gun. Oh, no, that's a regular machine gun. Uh, and you also get a um, rocket launcher. Let's see if we can take some of these guys out real quick. I can probably get this guy real quick too. Hey, the ah, what the damn them both thing. There is a crank on the terrace. You will need to operate it if I'm to pass through. I wonder what would happen if Yeah, I got the power. Just have to Oops. This particular trainer is that, uh, uh, it's a long trainer for this game. You have to have some bullets on hand for the trainer to even work. Yeah, yeah, and I'm out of ammo, so that probably won't work. Yeah, that, uh, that definitely won't work like that. Um, do I have any for it? Maybe the Magnum might work. Maybe, maybe, maybe. No, over here! Far away. Here! Oh. Hey! Over here! That's right this way! Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, that show That old guy is gonna get himself the, um, killed. Trainer. Okay, here we are with the trainer. I, uh, I got this from, uh, GameCopyWorld.com. This is the only trainer up there that's plus 31, so it should be pretty easy to find. But uh, as of course, as you can see, it's all in Russian, uh, except for that. I had to uh, translate all that stuff, and this is where I be, uh, where I did the translation. That uh, that little uh, graphics enhancement is a color scheme change. You can revert back to uh, the other whenever you uh, want to. I am not quite sure, but I think that there's some cutscenes that that color scheme does not work with, and it messes the game up when you uh, are in the change color scheme and happen to uh, run into a cutscene that. Uh, um, can't be changed because, of course, it's a cutscene. For some reason, it uh, it messes the game up and it might crash. But 
typically it uh, 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 the game itself runs fine with that color scheme makes it uh, makes it a lot cleaner a lot clearer I, I don't understand why in the world that the, these game developers are doing this to these games they can have uh, much better games if they would uh, start uh, making these games uh, right and have all these options in them. Yeah, I know that this game was originally on the consoles and it was pretty much ported over to the PC, but still, that's that's no excuse. If you're wanting to make money off of this stuff, uh, you might want to start thinking about putting stuff into these games instead of screwing around like this. Because I, I've already finished the game and I was totally disappointed in this thing. But uh, that, that's uh, just a new little trick that uh, I discovered. I wanted to show you it all. Uh, more videos to come later. Uh, thanks for watching again.